Hey guys, my name is Flight here, aka Dog Chocolate Sexy, the self proclaimed sexy black man on back again. Yeah, so in case you guys didn't know, I have a sister. Now, see, I love my sister to death. Um, she's honestly like a mom to a second mom to me. Um, love her, but sometimes she can get on my nerves. When I say get on my nerves, I don't mean like act all bitchy, because don't tell her this, guys, but <laughs> ever since. Like I was eight years old and I found out what a period was. I have actually kind of kept a mental record and of like a written record of when both my sisters go on their periods. So that way I can know. I call it the red zone. Get it? Red zone. So this way, I know that pretty much once I get to the double digits of the month, I'm safe. I'm safe. That's like home base in PAG. So my sister's kind of like pro feminist, pro feminism, whatever you want to call it. I'm sure you guys know someone like this who's like. Girls for life. Girls are everything. I mean, they should rule the world. They, they're smarter than men. Especially that. She's big on the whole females are smarter than men, even though, you know, we're all people are, you know, equal. So, I remember this one time she was going on, like, a tangent or something about, like, how, ah, and it pretty much went like this. Oh my gosh, all men are, like, such pervs, blah, 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 blah. And, you know, just went on and on and on about how men are disgusting, they're perverts, they're no good men, and how all guys look at is a girl's face, her looks, and her beauty, and don't care about her personality. Two things are wrong with that. Okay, girls, don't get offended by this, but you do the exact same thing. I mean, come on. If a guy goes up to you and tries to, you know, chat you up or hit you up or anything, and he looks like he just woke up in shit, you're not gonna want to talk to him. Your first thing is like... He's a homeless junkie piece of two. Let's say that you were going to a job interview with me and you want me to give you a job, right? And you came in with like all these wrinkled, unironed clothes and like, you know, your hair was a tangled mess, you look like a Medusa, and like you just reeked of pure and utter skunk shite. Now I'm not gonna be like, oh, well, I mean, sure he looks, she or he or she looks like a homeless piece of shit and, you know, looks like he's got a little dookie somewhere in his hair, but maybe, maybe he's, like, very smart, maybe he's, like, a physicist, maybe he's a genius, maybe he's a chemist, you know? Maybe, maybe I should give this guy a chance, you know? Let him prove himself. No! I will not do that! <laughs> Man, it'd probably end up going something a little like this. Animal control! Animal control! We've got some wild beasts in my office. Please get it out of here. Martha! Martha, get the kids! We're leaving! Here's the thing with looks. Looks are like your appearance is kind of like a gateway to your personality. You see, a guy will see a girl, he'll be like, oh, she looks nice. She looks... Okay, no. <laughs> Guys will be like, damn, she looks fine. Or like, she looks hot. I'll be honest. And, <clears throat> you know, he'll probably go up to her because she looks hot. But... If she's looking like a hot mess, which is the opposite of hot, so if she's looking like a awful, just awful, you know, a guy's not gonna go up to her and be like, huh, I bet, I bet she's, she'd be nice to talk to, you know, a, a nice companion I can have. You see, in my mind, I can only imagine how life would be like if men looked at personality before beauty. And here are just a couple scenarios that I see. Check, check it out. What, man? Oh. 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 Oh, damn. I know, right? Look, look. Oh. Look at her personality, man. I know, right? Like, she looks so outgoing. Hey, come on. Stop staring at her. I'm sorry, man. It's just that her personality just traps me. Oh man, I would love to just engage her in a nice conversation. Damn, hey baby girl, is there a mirror in your pocket? Cause I can see myself engaging you in a polite conversation over dinner about your likes and your dislikes. 
and politics and some shit like that. Hey guys, if you like this video, please give me a like rating. Every like rating helps. If you want to hear some more of, of my hilarious vlogs, then please just subscribe. And if you subscribe, please really subscribe. Be an active subscriber. Check out all my videos. Honestly, I don't want to have like 200 subscribers and like 20 views. That's some bull bullshit. So please leave a like. It takes two seconds. And peace.